Hey, welcome to Haphazard Homestead. I'm not a fancy person, but I've got a confession to make. I really like balsamic vinegar. Now, $50 a bottle, that's a little steep, but this grocery store salad dressing just doesn't quite cut it. So what's a person to do? I say, hey, I'm gonna go use my spruce trees. In this video, I'm going to show how I make some great balsamic vinegar from my spruce trees. I'll also show some ways that I'm using that spruce tree balsamic vinegar to really make the most out of that spruce flavor. You may be thinking, how do I even know if this is worth watching? How do I know if this stuff is even any good? Well, let's have an independent assessment right up front. I entered my spruce tree balsamic vinegar into our county fair. Here's what happened. And so there you go, it got first place. How about that? That's not bad. It had a little note on the back and that note says, delicious, delicious, delicious. I should strain off more of the solids and the sediment. I don't want to do that. They want all that spruce tips out of there, but that's part of it. You just put that in, it's tasty. That's good stuff. Delicious, they tasted it. This spruce tree balsamic vinegar is really easy to make. It uses the new spring growth of any spruce tree. To find out more about picking spruce, check out one of my earlier videos in the iCard in the upper right or in the link down below. I started by chopping up the spruce tips. I put two cups of the chopped spruce tips in a jar and added an equal amount of apple cider vinegar. Then I added 10 peppercorns and, and two tablespoons of honey. This is honey from bees here on the homestead, but that's really all it takes. Apple cider vinegar, peppercorns, and honey. Mm, you have that right now with honey and those spruce tips. Oh, ma'am. A little bit of... <coughs> oh, that'll wake you up. Mm -hmm. To finish it up, I just put the lid on the jar and then turned it to mix it. I kept it in the dark and turned it every few days. By the time of the county fair, I had let it sit about three months. So how am I using this spruce tip balsamic vinegar? Generally, just like any balsamic vinegar, like in this dish to the right with some nice olive oil. Mm. That is so good. That's delicious. Mm. But there's a nice bonus too. Those marinated spruce tips are great on their own. Like here, chop fine and use to top this cheese. Mm. It almost seems wrong to have this piece. I also use it to marinate homegrown vegetables like these heirloom tomatoes, sweet onions, and bell peppers. These apples grilled with the spruce tips and the balsamic vinegar, they are so good, I'm gonna do a video special just for that, so stay tuned. Now, some balsamic vinegar purists may be saying, hey, isn't balsamic vinegar made out of grape juice instead of apple cider vinegar? Well, next year, I'm gonna be adding some of my own home canned grape juice to this recipe, so be sure to be subscribed to see how that turns out. Or try it yourself with your own spruce tips and let me know how that works for you. I hope things are going well at your place. I'd love to hear your comments and have you subscribe for maybe a little different perspective about simple living close to the land. Thanks for watching. Bye.